Okay, well, here's camp that we rolled into last night. We're gonna take you down the, uh, the mile and a half uh, trail that we rode in the dark. Very little light. Very little. It wasn't pitch black to be fair, but our, our uh, <laughs> no, and our, <laughs> both of our handlebar bags are kind of blocking our bike lights. So I totally had my bike light strapped to my, one of my uh, drop bars. And we camped right there last night. Probably didn't see my hand. We got some great shots on Sony too. But using long exposures, oh, it was so much, it was, it was gorgeous. Stars were out last night. Oh yeah. Because <clears throat> we camped just outside of Harper's Ferry. Christine and I do not advocate riding these kind of trails in the dark. Sometimes you have to because we were hanging out in Harper's Ferry probably a little too long. <laughs> But we didn't get here early enough for the shots, so we're gonna we made it a late morning and decided to try to try to get some of them in this morning. On the CNO trail too, I might add, Christina and I are running our tires a little bit lower pressure just to provide a little bit wider footprint. The trail we'll be riding today is a little bit more packed, like you saw coming in Harpers Ferry, so be that's critical but with some of that mud and stuff it just helps get your tires that much wider so we're right now we're running uh, I think 37 C 700 by 37 C or 38 C I don't get tired of tree tunnels and I don't get tired of river views Just left Harper's Ferry in a late morning, and we are cruising down the trail because right outside of Harper's Ferry, the trail is nice. It's on the Maryland side, and it's awesome. Yeah, and it's a gorgeous day. We are a little sad, it's our last riding day, full riding day, but at the same time, we have a uh, Still big things to do during this trip. But we'll be hitting uh, Washington DC tomorrow about this time. So yeah. Are you having a good time, Christina? Sure am. Yeah, yeah. Gorgeous trail. Mm. I love bike touring. So about 10 miles outside of Harper's Ferry, there's a little bit of a detour on the towpath that takes us down little rocky incline. With our bikes this heavy, we don't try to tackle any of this stuff. Well, there's signs saying dismounted, every, you know, dismount everywhere, but we don't try to tackle any of this stuff when it comes up. How's it going? Good. Well, we've met so many nice people on this trail and they've given us pointers and, you know, meeting up with people headed the other way, you can swap stories and swap pointers and stuff. It's really great. Ooh, wow. That's why there's a detour. Let me get down here and I'll swivel the camera around so you can see. That's why there's a detour. <laughs> the bridge is gone. <laughs> oh. Christina asked me earlier if she, uh, if I think she could jump that. And I told her she probably could if she had a bigger ramp. <laughs> yeah, because I'm the one who would ask that question. You're totally the one that would ask that question. <laughs> no, it's me. Let's be honest, it's me. It's totally me. 
Yeah, but this whole trail has been gorgeous. And today's riding has been really nice. Yeah, really nice. Um, yeah. Just come ride the trail. You know, it, it's uh, coming out of uh, Cumberland. It's it's a little rocky, and if it's just rain, it's a little muddy and stuff. But totally doable. And the the Papa Tunnel is open. Uh, we walked our bikes through, and that tunnel's long. If you're walking your bike through, it's almost it's like a like three quarters of a mile or something. You can fact check me on uh, Wikipedia or something later. But um, we met some people that rode through it, and. Uh, respect for one and two you crazy <laughs> and if those people ever see this video they know who i'm talking about oh <laughs> uh, but it's it's been a great trail and we're sad that it's coming to a close uh but we got another good 30 mile ride or so today um so yeah we're having fun just taking it slow and harper's ferry totally worth the time to explore it absolutely okay gonna go up the steep incline I know that sounds like a train, but it's not. It's my drive train. It's that gritty. <laughs> no, it's a train. I'm just kidding, it's a train. Train's the other way, man. Yeah, but everybody's seen a train before. They don't get to see us having a good time riding together, you know? Well, they watch our videos they have. We've gone about 310 miles so far on this trip. We've got about, I don't know, 50 miles roughly. Yeah. yeah. Plus it down the mall. Yeah, plus a little bit to the train station that'll take us through, uh, that route will take us in front of the Lincoln Memorial and the Washington Memorial. The Washington Monument. Right? So yeah. It's gonna be a good time. We'll catch the train on to Philadelphia for her cousin's wedding. You watch this, Jason? Can't wait to meet you, buddy. I hope you aren't tired of seeing locks in this video. Because we sure aren't, especially when they look like this. Lock number 29. <sighs> it is. Yep. They're all a little bit different. Just past Lock 27, a kind of gross looking pond, canal area. 
There's still water in it. There's still water in it. Yep. It's still fun. And I bet when the sun's truly out, there's turtles sunning themselves on those logs. They're very majestic turtles. Yeah, there's a lot of turtles around here. Another aqueduct. You okay? Yeah, I'm good. You just moved to the. <laughs> I was going behind you. You're good. <laughs> I totally just serpent. <laughs> yes. <laughs> ready to get some water on the uh, CNO? I am definitely ready to get some water on the CNO because I'm pretty thirsty. Yeah. How are we going to do that? Get pumping. Okay. There we go. Come on, baby. Get some water. There we go. It's iodine, huh? Okay, so the iodine comes out a little brown. Sometimes. Okay. It's a good tricep workout. <laughs> Got our water. Ready to get a few more miles down the trail? Ready. Awesome. We just uh, upset a spider on huh? So we'll let him be. Okay. Oh, that's fun. Oh, beautiful parts of the canal. Only about 19 miles outside of. Uh... Oh, hello. Hope you're doing well. <laughs> We're uh, about 19 miles outside of the center of DC. We're, I think, about three miles from camp, our campsite. Woo! Nats. Sorry. We don't want to tell you how many gnats we've eaten today. It might consist of a meal. Okay. Oh, look at that river. It's super pretty. Mostly it's been unseen because of trees and that stuff, but every now and then you get a nice glimpse. Awesome. Can you see him? You can, barely. Hey guys, we don't want to hurt you. But we definitely need to get by. <laughs> Down into camp we go. Overnight campsites. Are they free? Yeah. Cool. Yeah, this is one of the hiker bikers one yeah. night limit. Cool. Let's go find a spot. Biked up to Great Falls. Woo! <laughs> Gorgeous. Absolutely stunning.
we come to Great Falls, walk all the way to the end of the Billy Goat Trail. are blessed with that. Let's have some pictures, baby. I love your face. I love your face. We bike trip together. It's fun. never going on the video but I just wanted to document it for us poor man's Mexican <laughs> it's so delicious in our tent with a towel for a tablecloth <laughs> it's great it's tomorrow night we're gonna be having steak and chicken at Jason's wedding rehearsal, or his rehearsal dinner. dinner we're so excited so much rest Real up. food yeah <laughs> we'll have to tame my hair because I don't know what the f*** that is. I hope our crap got to got to Chris's house. Because if not, guess what, buddy? <laughs> Going to the wedding in bike shorts.